Good morning. I'm glad you're all here. Oh boy. Ah, good morning, everybody. Oh boy. I'm ready to start. Are you? The more we read together, 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 the more we read together, the happier we'll be. We'll read big books and small books and short books and tall books. The more we read together, the happier <laughs> we will. <laughs> Good morning. Oh, hi, Maya. Hi, Kira. Oh, and Brooks. Oh, good. I'm glad you're here. I got the special poem for you today. I promised. All righty. Did you bring some magic with you? Because it's time to put some into the magic hat. Because it's empty. You're going to put some in there. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Something right there on your nose. We'll put that in there. Wait a minute. Here's some. I'll put that in my ear like that. And pull it out of that ear and put it in the hat. <laughs> Wait a minute. Here's some. Oh, put that in my ear. Oh. Pull it out of my mouth and put that in the hat. Yeah. And I'll take all that magic and stir it all up. Honk my nose. And say, And look at the pretty colors I have. Ooh. Oh, what color is this one? Orange. Yep, that's right. And this one is green. And this one, yellow. Uh -huh. Oh, there's another one. <gasps> looky, looky, looky. <gasps> Purple, yellow, green, and orange. And <gasps> there's somebody else inside the hat. I wonder who it could be this week. Shall I give you some hints? Okay, this is an animal that you'd probably find in a pond. It hops. It's got a big, long tongue to catch flies with. <laughs> Have you guessed what it is yet? <laughs> if you guessed a uh, froggy, you are right. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. <laughs> How funny is that, huh? Oh, boy. Well, you know what I'd like to be doing. <laughs> yeah. I'd be playing in the toy store all the live long day. I'd be playing in the toy store just to pass the time away. Can't you hear the dollies crying? Oh, please, don't ever go home, Mr. Paul. Can't you see me cry? <laughs> and pout her. I don't want to go home. <laughs> oh, I understand, I understand. I can play at home home today. I understand, I understand, I can play at home, but I can play where I want to, I can play wherever I care to, I can play when I want to, as long as I play all day. <laughs> yeah. Alrighty, Rudy. Oh boy, hi. Hi, Aria, and Rylan, and Reeve, you're here too. And who else do we have? Oh, Teague and Brielle. Oh, welcome, welcome. I'm glad you're all here today. Do you have your banana peels ready? Let's get our banana peels ready. Bananas unite. 
peel bananas, peel, peel bananas, peel bananas, peel, peel bananas, chop bananas, chop, chop bananas, chop bananas, chop, chop bananas, smush bananas, mush, mush bananas, smush bananas, mush, mush bananas, eat bananas, eat me bananas, eat bananas, eat me bananas, go. Alrighty, you ready to march to the beat? Remember how to do that? Let's see if we can do this together. Here, we'll turn the camera up a little bit. There we go. And we go. Marching, ready, marching. Marching to the beat. And clapping with our hands. With everyone we meet. Our legs like rubber bands. And then we stop and freeze. Not moving anything. I hope I'm not about to sneeze. I want to dance and sing. So clap your hands, stomp your feet, turn yourself around. Reach your hands up to the sky and now let's touch the ground. Hold your head, hold your hips. Give yourself a hug. Sit right down upon the ground. Oh, uh, watch out for the bugs! Yeah. <laughs> Alrighty. Okay. I have a story for you today. And we'll get this all in here so I can do it so that you can see everything. This is a story. It's actually called a fable. And that means there's a moral or a lesson at the end. And this is a story about a crow. Now this crow was very, very thirsty one day. And he was looking all around, trying to find something to drink. And look what he found. A glass of water. But he couldn't get his beak in there to get some water. He couldn't drink. And so he had an idea. He put a couple of pebbles in the water and he noticed that the water moved. And so he put some more pebbles in, one by one. Boy, it took him a very long time, but he kept putting another pebble in there and another pebble, another pebble, and another pebble. And look, the water started getting up higher and higher. And so he put some more in there, just like that. And pretty soon, the crow could reach his beak in and drink. <gasps> and he was so happy. And the moral of this story, the lesson is, little by little does the trick. Just keep doing a little bit at a time, and you'll end up with something big. All righty. Well, shall we let Pearl out of the box? Let's let Pearl out. Oh, boy. Uh, ready, Pearl? Ready to come out? Ready to come out? Ready? No. She wants us to sing the squirrel song. Will you sing the squirrel song with me? I'm going to sing it. I'm going to sing it. Remember, you stand up and then you kind of scrunch down a little bit so you can shake your tail. And we sing, squirrel, squirrel, shake your little tail. Squirrel, squirrel, shake your little tail. Wrinkle up your little nose, stick it in between your toes. Squirrel, squirrel, shake your little tail. All right. Hey, Pearl, will you come out now? Huh, sweetie pie? Hi, buddy. Hi. Hi. What's the matter? Look. Look out, look out there. Pearl, look, look, look. Yeah, I know. I know you get so excited when you see kids. Pearl, 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 put me. Pearl, get it, get, come on, come on, Pearl, Pearl. Okay, sit down, sit down, sit down. Will you go see the kids now? You will? Okay. Remember what to do. Hold your hand out like that. He's going to come over here and sniff you. Oh, hi, Aria. Hi, Rylan. Hi, hi, Reed. You getting, getting pearl love? Getting pearl love? <laughs> yeah. 
Oh, 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 she's blowing you a kiss. I love you so much. You know, I love to sing this song to her because on the day you came home, I felt my heart get a little bit bigger. On the day you came home, I felt it swell, swell, swell. On the day you came home, I felt my heart give a little giggle. And I knew it would be a better world. Love you, Pearl. Should I say bye-bye? Bye-bye, everybody. All righty. Well, boy, oh boy, oh boy. What do we have now? Oh, you know what? I think we had an icky sticky. Oh boy, let's icky sticky. Are you ready? Here we go. We'll get up closer to you. Yep, oh, there we go. All right, here we go. Icky sticky, icky sticky, honey and jam, honey and jam. My hands stick to my... Where should they stick? Hmm, my knee and my nose. Pull up, pull down, pull around and around all day until they finally pull away. <gasps> Let's do it again. Icky sticky, icky sticky, honey and jam, honey and jam. My hands stick to my... Hmm, how about ear and chin? Pull up, pull down, pull around and around all day until they finally pull away. Oh boy, I think I'm getting some ears. Okay, we got ear, belly, and head. Oh my goodness, how are we going to do that? Ear, belly, and head. Okay, well my ear's on my head, so I can do it with that and that. And there's my belly. How about that? Will that work? Okay, here we go. Pull up, pull down, pull around and around all day until they finally pull. Heck, now we need to wash our hands off. So this is where we pretend we've got a sink with a faucet and some soap. Turn on the water. Get your hands good and wet. Huh? Get some soap suds, puppy bottle, <laughs> put your hands back together and let's sing. Tops and bottoms, tops and bottoms, in between, in between, I rub them all together, I rub them all together, now we're clean. Alrighty, okay. Oh, here's a new magic trick for you today. Here is one. And actually, maybe I'll even teach you this one on my YouTube channel. Look at this. See this rubber band is around these two fingers? I'm going to make a jump over to these two fingers. Watch. Just make a fist and then open my hand. Boop! Look, they're over there. Oh, look at this. Do it again. Boom! They're back! Do it again. Boom! One more time. Boom! Now, a lot of people think it's just flying over here to there. But what if I made a little trap like this? So there's no way that could happen. See? What happens now? <laughs> That's kind of a fun trick, isn't it? Alrighty. Now, I have another little fable for you. And Fluffy is going to help us tell this one. Yep. See, Fluffy. He's got this great big bone. Oh, and he loves bones more than anything else. He loves to chew on bones. <laughs> but you know what would happen? Well, one day he was walking through the forest and he came to a bridge. And he climbed up on the bridge and he looked over the side. And the water was so still 
that he could see his reflection, just like a mirror. Well, he looked over there, but you know what? The doggy didn't, Fluffy didn't realize it was his own reflection. He thought it was another dog with another bone. And he thought, oh boy, I want that bone too. And he <gasps> fell in the water. And when he climbed back up to the bank, he couldn't find his bone anywhere. It fell in the water too. <gasps> oh, well, the moral of this story is you might lose what you have by trying to get more. So keep on to what you have. What do you think, Fluff? Oh, 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 you're going to give him kisses. Come with Fluffy. <laughs> I know. You love those kids, don't you? Yeah, you do. All right. Will you hop back in the box for me? Good job. Thank you, Fluffy. Thank you, Fluffy. Oh, boy. Now... Piper, I don't know if you're out there today, but Piper sent me a picture here, and she told me all about it. And then she wrote me all these instructions and told me exactly what it was. And you know what it is? This is a bunny city. And look, I've got a key to the bunny city. This is the key to the bunny city, and this is the city. And in the city, there's a house. And in that house, there's a bedroom. And in that bedroom, there's a bow. And under that bow, there's a cradle. And in that cradle, there's a pink blanket. And under that pink blanket, there's a bunny, a baby bunny. Baby bunny under the pink blanket. Pink blanket in the cradle. Cradle under the bow. Bow in the bedroom. Bedroom in the house. House in the bunny city. And this is the key to the bunny city. And this key is going in this envelope with a letter to Piper. All righty. Oh, boy. Let's see. What should we do? Oh, hey, guess what? I found a book that I can read. This is a book that I can read. I know it's backwards for you that can read, but, you know, when we get back up to YouTube, it'll be the right way around. But this is called When We Were Very Young, and it was written by a guy named A.A. A. Milne. His name was Alan Alexander Milne. And he also wrote some stories that I'll bet you know. Have you ever heard of Winnie the Pooh? Mm-hmm. Well, I'm going to tell you something. See this picture right here? This picture of some stairs and a little boy sitting right on the middle of the stairs. And look way up here. It's a little bear. Well, I know something. This is Christopher Robin. And that is Winnie the Pooh. And this is a poem that maybe you've heard Scooter of the Muppets sing. It goes like this. Halfway down the stairs is a stair where I sit. There isn't any other stair quite like it. It's not at the bottom. I'm not at the top. So this is the stair where I always stop. Halfway up the stairs isn't up and isn't down. It isn't in the nursery, it isn't in the town. All sorts of funny thoughts run round my head. It isn't really anywhere, it's somewhere else instead. I like that story. I like that song. I hope you do, too. Okay. Oh, would you like to swing on a star? Carry moonbeams home in a jar. You'd be better off than you are. Or would you rather be a mule? A mule is an animal with big funny ears. He kicks up at everything he hears. 
His back is brawny and his brain is weak. He's just plain stupid with a stubborn streak. And by the way, if you hate to go to school, you may grow up to be a mule. <coughs> or would you like to swing on a star? Carry moonbeams home in a jar. And be better off than you are. Or would you rather be a pig? A pig is an animal with dirt on its face. His shoes are a terrible disgrace. He's sloppy and he's dirty and he's grungy up front. And when he talks, all he does is grunt. And by the way, if you don't care a feather or a fig, you may grow up to be a pig. Or would you like to swing on a star? Carry moonbeams home in a jar. And be better off than you are. Or would you rather be a fish? A fish is an animal that swims in a brook. It can't write a poem or read a book. Its only purpose is to fool you. Oh, and only if you remember the song. And by the way, if that's what you wish, you may grow up to be a fish. And all the monkeys aren't in the zoo. Every day you'll meet quite a few. So you see, it's all up to you. You could be better than you are. You could be swinging on a star. Yeah, you could be swinging on a star. Alrighty. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. What would you guys like to do now, huh? Do we have another story? Okay, I'm gonna do another story. Alrighty. Okay, this is a story about a fox and a lion. Now, the lion was scary to the fox. The fox thought that lion, oh, lion could eat me up. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Well, one day the fox was walking along and he saw the lion. Oh, and he ran! He ran! Well, the next day the fox came back and he saw the lion and he went just a little bit closer and nothing happened. The lion just sat there and the fox went away. Well, the next day the fox came back, only this time he got even closer closer to the lion, and nothing happened, so the fox went away. And the next day, the fox came back, and he got very, very close to the lion, and they started talking, and they stayed, they actually made friends! Yeah, they did, they did, and they said, oh boy, we're fun! Hey, what, what do you want to play tomorrow? Should we play tag? Oh boy, let's jump rope! I like jump rope, that's fun! Okay, great! And the fox went away, and the both of them knew they could play another day, and, well, the moral of this story is, Familiarity breeds contempt, which just is a fancy way of saying, the more you get to know somebody, the nicer they become. Yeah, you stop forgetting about them being scary. Okay, alrighty guys. We're getting to kind of towards the end, and I always want to know if there's something that you guys want to do that we haven't done yet. Okay, how about the gumdrop song? You remember the gumdrop song I did last week? This is where you pretend that the rain's coming down, but lemon drops and gumdrops, candy's coming down instead. <laughs> if all the raindrops were lemon drops and gumdrops, so oh, what a world this would be. I'd stand outside with my mouth open wide. If all the raindrops were lemon drops and gum drops, oh, what a world this would be. Yeah! Oh, peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Okay. We'll make a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Because you asked. That's the fun of doing this live, you guys. You get to choose what we do. Okay? All righty. What are we going to need here? We're going to need some jelly and some peanut butter. 
And we're gonna need the rest of this stuff. Hang on there, I'm still here. I'm still here, I'm still here. Here we go, here we go. We're gonna need some bread. There's some bread. Yeah, and we'll put that bread in the magic bag so we can keep it right there, see? There it is, right there. Okay, now. Yeah. We have jelly over here, and we have peanut butter over here. Now we're gonna cover up the peanut butter and cover up the jelly. What's under here? Peanut butter. Under here? Jelly. Peanut butter. Jelly. Peanut butter. Jelly. <laughs> Until we do the magic. Peanut, peanut butter, and jelly. So what do you think is over here? Peanut butter. That's right. And over here we have... Jelly! <laughs> All right, let's move them back. Peanut, peanut butter, and jelly. So over here we have jelly. Over here we have peanut butter. Let's move them back. Peanut, peanut butter, and jelly. So over here we have peanut butter. And over here we have jelly. Oh, this is fun. Here we go. <gasps> peanut, peanut butter, and peanut butter. Oh, uh oh. Peanut butter. Peanut butter. Oh, let's make them both jelly. <gasps> jelly, 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 and jelly. Over here we have jelly. Over here we have jelly. Okay, all right. Let's get them back to where they were at the beginning. Peanut, peanut butter, and jelly. So over here we have peanut butter. And over here we have jelly. All righty. That's it. Now we know. Now we know. Let's see what happened to the bread. Let's see what happened to the bread. Oh boy. <gasps> Peanut butter and jelly. Alrighty, folks. Hey, before we leave today, today is a really special birthday day in my family. Oh, it's somebody's birthday. The most important person in the whole wide world to me is her birthday today. You know who it is? My mommy. My mommy is 94 years old today. And you know what else? My nephew and his wife are in the hospital right now. And they're going to have a baby today. Day on my mommy's birthday. Isn't that fun? <laughs> I'm so excited. So would you would you like to sing happy birthday? Would you sing happy birthday to Mr. Paul's mom with me, please? <laughs> All right. I'm gonna start it off with this. You are you, the only you, and you and you alone. And you that's you, you know it's true. Another year you've grown. Today's the day, this special day, we sing and dance and play. Because of you, my friend, that's you. We shout and sing and say, Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Paul's mom. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Love you, Mommy. Oh, and look at all these people saying happy birthday. All righty. Is there anything else that you would like me to do before I do the ending song? This is a good time to ask right now. It me fun? <laughs> uh oh. Whoa. Oh, rainbows in my mouth. <laughs> pretty silly, pretty silly. Okay, what have we not done yet? I think we're probably about done. Anything else you guys really, really want to do?
Let's see. I'm just going back. I'm sorry. I'm looking back through the notes and seeing all your comments just to make sure. Oh boy. And I'm going to look down my things here. Oh boy. How about... Zoom, zoom, zoom. We're going to the moon. Zoom, zoom, zoom. We're going to the moon if you want to take a trip. I'm aboard my rocket ship. Go zoom, zoom, zoom. We're going to the moon in five, four, three, two, one. Blast off! Up to the sun because that's fun, fun, fun. We're going to the sun. Fun, fun, fun. We're going to the sun if you want to take a trip. Climb aboard my rocket ship. Cause fun, fun, fun. We're going to the sun in five, four, three, two, one. Blast off! Where would you like to go? Hmm? Candyland? Oh, you bet we can go to Candyland. Let's go to Candyland. And, well, well, do you know disappearing tricks? Oh, interesting. Yes, I do. All right, we'll do a, um, okay, wait a minute. We're going to go Candyland first. We're going to take our hand. Hand, hand, hand. We're going to Candyland. Hand, hand, hand. We're going to Candyland. If you want to take a trip, climb aboard my rocket ship. Because hand, hand, hand. We're going to Candyland in five, four, three, two, one. Blast off! Alrighty. We wanted a little disappearing trick, so we'll do a little quick disappearing trick. Yeah, let's see. Here we got my scarf, this blue scarf right here. Okay? And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it right here inside of my fist. Okay, going right there in my fist, just like that. Right, yeah, and whoop! Whoop! No, you saw it. You saw it. It's right there. Yeah. Yeah, it's right there. Oh, you want to see that again? Okay, all right. Here, let's try it again. Here we go. We put it right in here. some other tricks, some other magic tricks, and some disappearing tricks for you next week. Make sure you come back, because we're going to have more fun next week. And don't forget that a little bit later, this video will be on Mr. Paul's Place on YouTube. It's been so nice to have this time together, just to have a laugh and sing a song. Seems we just get started, and before you know it, comes the time we have to say so long. See you later, alligator, in a while, crocodile. Give a hug, ladybug, blow a kiss, jellyfish. See you soon, you big baboon, out the door, dinosaur. To loo, kangaroo, who wave goodbye, butterfly. See you next week. Thanks for coming today. I love you all.